is a super Sunday and is a super clash. The two glamorous sights in Ghana football, Accra Hot Savok and Kumasi Asante Kotoko, line up in the round of 31 of the 2020-2021 Ghana Premier League. This is Hot Savok and Asante Kotoko. It is the super clash on a super Sunday in the capital. Yeah, it's a big one. Really big one for these two sides because of the way the league has unfolded. Kotoko and Hot Savok leveled on the same points, only separated by goal difference. But at the end of the day, see the hats for keep their planes on top of Kumasi Asante Kotoko. He serves them to that place. So there's plenty that is at stake. There's plenty that hangs on this one. And I tell you what, we are in for what would be, I think, a cracker. You know, like you said, hats for has been over a decade since they won this one. And you have a feeling that if there's going to be a team that can stop them from winning, and then it's Kumasi Asante Kotoko. But in the mood in which the Phobians are, they have a real belief that this could be their year. It's familiar faces. Been paraded by coach Samo Abuedu. The only change from that game against the Gun Cities is Frederick and Saboche, who drops to the bench for Emmanuel Nete. Samo Abuedu keeping up with consistency in the squad. No surprises in the call up. It's a 4 3 3 system, as you respect. Salif Ibrahim will be the one to play the free role. But keep an eye on Daniel Free, Banya, Razak Patrick. They are going to be playing very close to Obin Jr. They are going to be narrow. But I normally like to start the attack with Radio Vuk and the captain Fatal Mohammed. Kumasi Asante Kotoko, familiar faces. Interestingly, Kwame Ba gets to keep the post. Razaka Balora is not in the match day squad. Imoro Ibrahim, the regular left back, is on the bench. His place is taking back. Patrick, Patrick Asma on the left hand side. Emmanuel Keke starts in midfield together with Abib Mohamed and Muna Siru Salifu. Yeah, Dama is going to go through the middle as the first number nine. But as the game progresses, I expect him to drop a little deep or deeper into midfield. Where you see Emmanuel Jemfi. The battle lines are gone. Game underway here at the Accra Sports Stadium. Asante Kotoko kicks off in his right foot, but it looks like it's Salifu who sets up Nete. Nete with a power drive, but it is. Yeah, right from the training ground there. A little bit of disguise from Salifu. But Gamma does well here to charge from the wall, try to close the angle. There you see him closing down on Nete. He's got a range in his, in his boot. Emmanuel Nete lines up for the free kick. Nete! The flies over the bar as a goal kick. Only well, had one thing on his mind to go through the laces and try to pick the keeper with the pace of the strike, but the boy is always rising, nowhere near trouble. Here is Ibrahim, he's got space. Heavy first touch manages to find Fatal down the right. He's got asthma, sends a deep cross in. Patrick Razak said across. Daniel Barnier shot is blocked by Canoe. Shouts for a penalty, but no. Yeah, that's the earlier chance there. Once Salifu was bringing in the ball, Kotoko's defence kept backing off, backing off, and he had the opportunity of picking his captain. The cross to the far post this time is good. And then Patrick Azak is... Nete goes for it. Patrick Asma! Good save from pa goalkeeper Richard Atta. He tried to stop the ball, but the wall broke, actually. It did break. But it's a good effort from Asma there. The bend is good. It's getting over the top of the wall. Bro. Says Mariano Barreto to go and love you back here from Genfi. Now Patrick Asma whips in across straight to Richard Atta. Cup and the Ghana Premier League Genfi. Yeah. Afutu with a lovely pass, good control from Fatah Mohamed. And the woodwork saves Kotoko. An awkward clearance from Abib and Kwame Ba will grab it. To make sure he's putting him under pressure, defending from here is very good. Keep your man under pressure, stopping from picking his spot. Fatal showed great strength as well, but he was forced into playing the ball in the way he did. Now Mudrasiru goes past Daniel Barnier. Lovely pass onto the path of Genfi. Emmanuel Genfi's cross. Nearly an own goal. Yeah, that's that's the ball. That, that is the, the danger there. If Hatsufuka flooding forward with the full backs, it's Genfi who gets into the space. The cross is really good. The cross is heading straight into Gam and more has a nose. That it, I do so I should say knows they need to get something on it because Gamma is lurking. Great strength. And first half is over. Ladies and gentlemen, action and Daniel Lyas signals the two teams back into action and it's Asabok who gets us under Santi Kotoko. Mohamed Al Hassan. Lovely ball to Fatal Mohamed sends a cross. That's some good stuff from Ganyu. Brilliant drive from and a good save from Kwame Ba. You're well dealt with by Daniel there. You should have 
done a lot better with the clearance. The ball just drops to the, to the feet of... Yeah, it's a poor clearance. The ball drops to the feet of Salif Ibrahim. Who was only going for power. I didn't really pick a spot. The ball straight at Kwame Ba, who makes the save in the end, but... Avoka's pass is meant for Bingina. He flicks it on. Here is Salif Ibrahim. Wasted so much time. Patrick Razak. And it deflects up Apeo. This is in behind the cutter side is emerging and beginning to look dangerous for them. Now that flick on there to Salifu, I told you they, they played closely to each other. Salifu didn't really go first time to find Bandy who was on the far post. Yeah. Mohamed Al Hassan. Shoot for Opping. Now here's Patrick Razak. Sets up Salifu Ibrahim. That's a good block from Apel. Where the, the play develops, had to put pre and ball into the channel. But Bani does well, puts pressure. Ball gets into Fatal and uh, into Patrick Razak's path. But just couldn't gather the ball under his ball. Couldn't really control the ball well. Ball got stuck in between his legs. Sets up Salif, whose effort was blind. I thought it was also going. And that was a chance for Hats. If only Patrick Razak could have gathered that ball well. A very improved side in the second half. Again, a dink. From Salifu looking for Barnier. That's the opener. Daniel Afriya Barnier. Daniel Afriya Barnier has broken the deadlock. Hak Savok are up by one nil. And how important he was for this side. And again, the chance of Foku are looking at the better side. The little drink over the top from Salifu to Bani. It's not the first time we've seen it this season. Obi Junior's effort has blown well by Kanu. But the short is a hope for one. No question marks about offside. But it's a really good finish. It's an incredible finish by Bani. It really is because it's on the half turn. But still does want to generate enough power and puts a bit of spin about the effort. Kwame Barkan now to get a hand to it. But it's a difficult one to keep out into the roof of the net. By the goalkeeper, and it's the opener. Daniel Efriye Banier is the man right here. He's the man in form. He's the man who's put hard to foot. Fabio Gama swings one in. Richard Atta failed to make the ball comes in here. He didn't, he didn't really cut out the first time. Was the put it under a bit of pressure by Habib on the other end of the pitch. Not happening. Kataka close to the equalizer. Nearly bringing Kotoko back to business. Yeah, it's, it's net his ball into the box. It's a good one, but Fatal doesn't see him. He just spins off his back. Doesn't know where the danger is. Vico for them. Ofuka has been great running down the channels. It's over! Akra Hatsabok have taken a three point lead. And it's a glorious Akra Hatsabok one. Asante Kotoko nil.